Hey guys, so I actually filmed the video already. So this is my second take. It's because the entire time I was like this. In my life, as of right now, I'm Why do I look I so calm? My main <sighs> Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So... I was editing it, I was like, this video is so boring. I wouldn't want to watch this video, so... Hence, I've decided to refilm this for you guys. Oh, the lighting shit now, but I guess shit person shit lighting comes together. Let's answer damn questions again. Also, like, I just- I put you guys just now on the phone stand, but right now, you guys are downgraded. Downgraded to a sofa pillow. Okay. Oh my god. All shit. Okay, here's a... Big sister talk, welcome to my channel. Hi, I'm Ruru. Nice to meet you. If this is the first video you're watching, I'm so sorry. So I asked you guys on Instagram to ask me about beauty related stuff and surprisingly many people, not surprisingly, you guys always ask me the same shit over and over again. I'm tired of it, that's why I'm making this video, okay? How do I shave legs without getting cuts? First of all, I don't know how you're getting cuts all the time. Seriously, no, if you already plan to not have hair for a long time, okay, let's just say for a long time, then just go for an IPL. There's a lot of unlimited like zaps or packages that you can get for like a really cheap price for like eternities, like literally unlimited. Get those on board for yourself. Guys and girls, don't worry. Walk inside, the lady will be nice to you, don't worry, you're just a customer, don't think too much. Aside from cardio and diet, what can I do to lose fat? Cardio and diet and see maybe if that's what you're lacking keep going don't don't give up keep going Next have you ever had bags under your eyes? What do you recommend besides sleep? Um, personally, I don't have much um, Eye back problems <laughs> I don't have much eye back problems. I can't help you. Sorry. What is your armpit skincare? So um, I actually don't grow armpit hair so I can't help you guys, girlies, if you have armpit problems. I heard from other friends that you just need to get IPL. Just get it lasered off. How do you keep your face clear? So my overall overall skincare routine consists of... I will put the pictures of the products here. SK2 Treatment Essence, SkinCeuticals, Dior, Serum, and face mask every day. So I have this Korean face mask. So I have this lovely segment in my fridge where it's just all face mask. Okay? So I use this every day, so if you get stuff like this, it's like water-based So it's like really nice and soft on your skin Oh my god, by the way, if you guys can get your hands on this, this brand This particular mask, buy it Take the entire shelf, it's really good I use this mask every single time I need to go for an event I need to be in front of the camera quite a bit, then I will use that mask Back to the cushions, shall we? How to slim down if I refuse to exercise and have very little self-control towards food? Sis, I got bad news for you. <laughs> these are the only- actually, these are the only two factors that you need to control. I suggest that better mental headspace, and also when you have the time to do it, then you go and do it. Um, you don't need a solid plan. I actually heard this um, nutrition tip that I saw on this like shorts, YouTube shorts that I was watching. Focus on adding instead of subtracting. So which means that if you're used to eating like instant noodles every day, um, I do too, I eat instant noodles. Remember to add some eggs or like vegetables to you know keep the protein up and also add some vegetables into your diet. And I think that's a very easy way to introduce more healthier food into your own basically your own routine. How often do you work out on average and what are the workouts and sports that you do? I used to work out maybe four times a week in the gym but I no longer do that. I just got lazy after this year for a bit. I will go back on track someday but not now. But right now I'm just going to dance class two times a week and that's all. And it's also because of my schedule issues, I want to relax a little bit during the new year before I start training again. Actually never mind, let me bring the freaking Tripod. You guys are like sitting on the floor. Okay, I feel so bad. You know, I got a question on my eating disorder. I feel bad. Don't push yourself so hard that you that you get sick. Ooh, wow, this lighting is <laughs> tip number one in life. Don't get yellow lights for your house. Exercise routine and usual eating habits. So my eating habits is that I eat small meals a day. I cannot stand being full. I've said it multiple times. I like to eat small meals and 
throughout the day. I'm just constantly eating when I'm awake until after dinner time. And then, because after dinner, because okay, so okay, I wake up and I'm hungry as hell. Okay, I grab something to eat, and usually that's my largest meal of the day. And even if it's my largest meal, I still usually kind of finish my food. So during the period of time of like the midday, I'll have snacks while I complete my food. So when it comes to dinner time, I'm actually not that hungry, but I will still eat a meal. So after dinner, I'm usually too full. So I'm like, I'm good for the day. So I guess two and a half meals is usually what I swallow in a day. Tips for clear skin and silky hair. So um, I've talked about- Okay, you guys are falling. This is not a very good setup, but usually I wash my hair once every two days and I use um, these products. Um, the more and more hair water water hair treatment thing, try it. I've recommended it to my Twitch chat and some of them got it and they really loved it as well. It makes your hair super soft and like it just feels like you have new hair. It's just freaking insane. I have a Russian model friend called Anastasia. So I was in Korea and she was in Korea. She's uh, she's working in Korea by the way. So I was like, Onni, how do you maintain your hair? And she was like, girl, drags me to Olive Young buys the product and be like, somewhere which is like present in Korean. And I'm like, really? Then she's like, yeah, take it, try it, it's amazing. I'm like, okay. So I tried it on the night that she gave it to me and my life was changed. I was so impressed at the point where the next day I tried, I went to another Olive Young to buy another one for my mom as a present. You seem to always be so busy. How do you take care of yourself with such limited amount of time? I used to be more unbalanced with Damn. I used to be more unbalanced with my timeline, so I used to always work, work, work until I dropped dead. I still do that sometimes, but I feel like I'm definitely learning to cope with my time better. After I'm done with work, I'm done with work. And I make sure to set aside like an hour to two hours before bed to make sure I'm winding down, listening to music, I'm just like using my phone, thinking about like creative ideas. Like what a lot of people don't know about creative people is that you need to be constantly surrounded by creative things to be creative. <laughs> Surprise! Doing that has like greatly improved my mental health and also given me a short creative burst which I needed. And then like, I'll do my entire skincare routine. I think that a lot of people think that skincare routine is like a Ah, kitana. It's like, how do I explain it in English? Annoying. For a lot of people, it's because you don't wind down. So if you take it as like, oh, I'm gonna spend 30 minutes on my bed using my phone anyway, so let's just put a face mask while I use it. I'm gonna be sitting on the toilet bowl pretending I'm trying to shed, but I'm actually just like using my phone. Why not put a face mask? Guys, there's a lot of opportunities in your life where there's like kind of like downtime. So I think that. It's good to take advantage of that time, you know, take care of your skin while doing something. One of the ways to incorporate it easily into your life. How to get a slim waist and tummy. Okay, so I have a lot of people asking me how do I get this gorgeous body. First, I need to thank my mom and my grandmother for giving me such a fat ass because, <laughs> because illusions matter, okay? So my waist is, I would say that it's pretty small. It's like 24, 23, 24 inches. But I feel like because of my proportions, it made it look smaller than it is. So I'm gonna teach you guys how to do this, okay? Write down, take out your notebook right now. I feel like a lot of girlies want like small waist and like they just keep doing ab workouts. Stop it, stop it! Train your shoulders and also train your ass. Why? Hourglass shape is basically an illusion of a hourglass, right? Training your shoulders will make the top part look a little bigger. Training your ass will make your ass bigger. So like, it gives the illusion of having an hourglass body. So what I did a lot when I was training is actually, actually I trained quite a bit of shoulders and also my ass and I honestly didn't do any ab workout. Pro tip, illusion. Basically just be a magician, that's all. Where do you usually shop for clothes? Um, Taobao. This is from Taobao. Very nice dress. It's very comfortable and most of my clothes are bought from Taobao. How do you keep your body skin so white? So first, just don't go out in the sun. That's my entire tip. Do you practice intermittent fast? I feel like I unconsciously do it sometimes because I eat after I wake up and then I just stop eating after dinner. But I don't do that on purpose and I feel like there are days where I don't intermittent fast as well. Like I just go out for supper or I just have a snack in between because I'm hungry and I'm up until like 4 a.m. So by the time it's like 2, 3 a.m. I'm hungry again. So I'll eat when I'm hungry. How is your skin so dewy and like nice? Guys, my skin is actually- oh my god, this is not here. 
Okay, anyways, my skin is actually really dry, you guys can tell, because I've been like sneezing so much and like I've just been blowing my nose constantly, so it's really dry and like I actually got sun damage over here, a little bit here Sis panic, went to the facial parlor instantly I was telling my usual girl like, sis, I messed up and she was like, oh no, what happened? I was like, I stand under the sun for too long and she's like, oh my god, no! All of my hard work! I was like, oh, this is it, I'm sorry! So she sat there and she made me literally scream and cry for a little while because like, she was um telling- because it was really painful. How I recovered from it is I- instead of face masking once a day, I up it to twice a day. So when I wake up, I do once and then before I sleep, I do it once more. How do you- I feel like the- I feel like I scroll- I'm scrolling through all of the responses and all of the questions are just asking like, how do you stay skinny? How do you stay skinny? I feel like- this is such an iffy thing though, this is just why I don't like to talk about it, but I've decided to talk about it, so I don't know what I'm doing. <sighs> Killing myself right now. The taste bud thing. I actually prefer healthy food most of the times, and it's like I would pick chicken breast over chicken thigh any day. I don't know why, too. I would pick a fruit over chocolate any day, too. I don't know why. It's like active conscious decisions that you make. According to my mom, okay, so mom theory, mom is never wrong anymore. Um, and my grandmother is that they were both really skinny when they were young. They only gained weight after they got pregnant. So it might be some sort of genetic as well. So never getting children forever. And how does one find good color combinations for outfits? So personally, I like to go with monochromes and neutral tones. So uh, if you guys, if you don't know what is that, um, I'll probably list the chart here. So it's like brown, beige, grays, black, blue, this kind of thing. And one solid color will always make me is that I have tattoos. So um, I usually like to wear one solid color to make sure that I am not overdoing it. I think it's my personal taste to like more simple and sleek looking kind of fashion. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Anyway, so if you guys enjoyed this video, um, I refilmed it a second time, so you guys will never see ever see that video again. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, and yes, I'm back on YouTube. Um, I'll try to film more videos, and there's a lot of videos I want to make, but I just hate to edit. I just hate to edit. See you guys in the next video. Remember to subscribe and like, and I'll see you next time. Bye.